tout cas là. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the drawing of lots of the qualifiers of the under 23 Africa Cup of Nations, Morocco 2023. This is the fourth edition of this competition. The first edition started in 2011, was won by Gabon. The second one in 2015 was won by Nigeria, and the last one in 2019 was won by Egypt. And this uh, competition, the qualifiers, will qualify, of course, to the final tournament in Morocco of the Under-23 Africa Cup of Nations. And the final tournament is qualifying, as you know, to the Olympic Games, which will be played in Paris 2024. In this edition, we have 39 engaged national associations. So Morocco, the host, is qualified automatically, and the 38 other associations are going to play the qualifiers. The qualifiers format as you know, is uh, by knockout rounds. Three rounds would be played knockout from home and away matches. So we must absolutely have uh, 18 exempted teams. So this way we will have 20 teams playing the first round, qualifying 10 teams to the second round. With the 18 exempted teams, will, will, will form 28 teams who will play knockout again to qualify 14 teams. And then the final seven will qualify to the final tournament in addition to the host, Morocco. The final tournament, as I said, will be played in Morocco next year, in June 2023. So, without taking too long now, I will start by explaining a bit the procedures of the draw. In the first round, the preliminary round, we split the teams geographically as much as possible. So, we have, for example, six non-exempted teams from Wafu A and Wafu B. So, we put them together in one pot, which is uh, pot A, and then we had four non-exempted teams from Sekafa, so we added to them the one non-exempted team from Enough and the one non-exempted team from Unifac to have them in pod B, six teams in total in pod B. And then in pod C, we had eight teams from Kozafa, so we put them all together. The teams of each geographical zone will play against another team from the same zone, so we are going to draw two balls from pot A who will play against each other, and then we repeat the same procedure in pot B, and then we finish with pot C, and we do the same until we finish the non-exempted team who will play the first round. In the second round, we distributed the teams by ranking. So according to the ranking established in the three last editions, the three editions of the Under-23 Africa Cup of Nations, so we have level one, level two, level three. Level one and level two are going to play against the winners of the first round, and level three will play against each other, and then when we come to this round, we will explain also how the third round will be proceeded. So now let's start by the drawing of lots of the first round. As I said, in pot A, we have the teams of Wafu, which, which are Gambia, Guinea-Bissau, Mauritania, Burkina Faso, Niger, and Togo. In pot B, we have four teams from Sekafa, one, one team from Enaf, and one team from Enifac, Avdi Congo, Ethiopia, Rwanda, South Sudan, Tanzania and Libya. And then in pot C, finally, we have the eight teams from Kozafa, Angola, Botswana, Eswatini, Madagascar, Mauritius, Mozambique, Namibia, and Seychelles. So now, let's start. I will be assisted by Yasmin. We will start by taking two balls from pot A who will play against each other. And the team drawn first plays always the first match at home. Guinea-Bissau. Guinea-Bissau will play match one and two, and the opponent will be... Niger. Niger. Guinea-Bissau will play against Niger. The first leg will be played in Guinea-Bissau, and the second leg will be played in Niger. As I said, always the team drawn first will play the first match at home. Let's proceed with pot B for matches three and four. Tanzania. Tanzania will play the first leg at home, and the opponent of Tanzania will be? South Sudan. South Sudan. First leg will be played in Tanzania, and second leg in South Sudan. 
Now we'll move to pot C, the teams of Kuzafa. And the next two teams will play matches five and six. Eswatini. Eswatini. We play the first leg at home. Let's see the opponent of Eswatini now. Botswana. Botswana. Eswatini will play against Botswana. First leg in Eswatini and second leg in Botswana. Now we'll repeat the same process again. We go back to pot A and we draw two teams. Mauritania. Mauritania will play matches seven and eight against the team that will be the one now. Togo. Togo. Mauritania will play against Togo. Matches seven and eight. First leg in Mauritania, second leg in Togo. We will move to pot B now. Ethiopia. Ethiopia will play matches 9 and 10 against the team that will be drawn now. RD Congo. RD Congo. The first leg will be played in Ethiopia and the second leg in RD Congo. We go now to the pot C to draw the next two teams who will play matches 11 and 12. Mozambique. Mozambique. And the opponent of Mozambique will be? Mauritius. Mauritius. The first leg will be played in Mozambique and the second leg in Mauritius. Now we go back to pot A to confirm the last two balls, the last two teams in this pot. And the first team, the one also to confirm the order of the matches, the first team, the one will play the first match at home. Burkina Faso. Burkina Faso. Against Gambia. Versus Gambia. One moment, Yasmin. We now still have uh, two balls in uh, pot B. We will draw the two balls of pot B and then we will proceed with the remaining four balls of pot C. Just to explain to everyone that in pot C we have more balls because we had eight teams non exempted from Kuzov. Let's continue now. The last two teams of pot B play against each other in matches 15 and 16. Libya. Libya will play the first leg at home. And to confirm the opponent of Libya. Rwanda. Rwanda. Libya will play against Rwanda in matches 15 and 16. And then the last two fixtures of the first round. The first two teams will play against each other. And the last two teams will play against each other in the last fixtures. Madagascar. Madagascar will play the first leg at home, March 17, and the opponent of Madagascar will be? So Seychelles. Seychelles. And then the last two teams of Kozafa will play the match, matches 19 and 20. The first team will play the first leg at home, as usual. Angola. Angola. And now let's confirm the opponent. Namibia. Namibia. This concludes the draw of the first round. Now we will move to the second round. Let me explain a bit again to you how the draw of the second round and consequently the third round will be proceeded because the third round is set by the order of the matches. 
Now to explain the second round. As I said, we have three levels in, according to the ranking of the last three editions. In level one, we have Egypt, Nigeria, Cote d'Ivoire, South Africa, and Algeria. In level two, we have Ghana, Senegal, Senegal, Gabon, Mali, Cameroon. In level three, we have Tunisia, Zambia, Congo, Sudan, Guinea, Sierra Leone, Uganda, and Benin. So to give, to give the advantage to level one and two, they are going to play the winners of the first round. And then the teams of level three will play against each other. We are also avoiding having two ranked teams from level one, for example, playing against each other in the third round. So what we will do, we will draw one ball from level one, and this team will play against the winner of match one and two. And then we will draw two balls from level three. They will play against each other, and the winner of these two fixtures will play against each other in the third round. And we are going to repeat the same procedure until we finish with level one and level three, and then we will uh, move to level two also to play against the remaining teams winning from the first round. So now let's start by uh, taking one ball from uh, level one. And this team will play against the winner of match one and two, Guinea Bissau Niger. Côte d'Ivoire. Côte d'Ivoire will play against the winner of Guinea Bissau Niger. And we will take two balls from level three. These two balls will play against each other, and the winner of this picture will play against the winner of uh, Guinea Bissau slash Niger versus Côte d'Ivoire. Sudan. Sudan. Sudan will play the first match at home. We are following the same system. So the team drawn first plays the first match at home. Sudan will play against... Benin. Benin. So Sudan against Benin. The winner of Sudan, Benin, will play against the winner of match one and two versus Côte d'Ivoire in the following round. We will repeat the same process. One team from level one. Okay, let's go. Nigeria. Nigeria. Nigeria will play against the winner of Tanzania versus South Sudan. And the winner of this fixture will play against the winner of the next fixture, having two teams from level three. This team will play in match 27-28. Guinea. Guinea. And Guinea will play in match 27 at home, the first leg. And the opponent of Guinea will be? It will be Uganda. Uganda. Guinea will play against Uganda, and the winner of Guinea, Uganda, will play in the third round against the winner of match three and four versus Nigeria. Match three and four is the uh, winner of Tanzania, South Sudan. Okay, let's move to the next team of level one. Egypt. Egypt. So Egypt is going to play against the winner of match five and six, which is Iswatini, Botswana. We now take two balls from level three. They will play against each other, and the winner will play versus the previous fixture, having winner five and six versus Egypt. Sierra Leone. Sierra Leone. And we will see now the opponent of Sierra Leone. Zambia. Zambia. So Sierra Leone will play against Zambia, first leg in Sierra Leone, second leg in Zambia, and the winner of this match will play against the winner of match five and six versus Egypt. Match five and six is Iswatini versus Botswana. Next team from level one. This team will play against the winner of match seven and eight, Mauritania Togo. South Africa. South Africa will play against the winner of Mauritania Togo. We take the remaining two balls from level three. These two teams will play against each other and the winner will play versus winner of seven and eight versus South Africa. Congo. Congo. Against. Tunisia. Congo versus Tunisia. 
Now we have one team remaining from level one. This team will play against the winner of match nine and ten, which is Ethiopia of the Congo. Let's confirm this team. Algeria. Algeria will play against winner of Ethiopia of the Congo. And since the teams of level three are finished now, the winner of uh, nine and ten, Algeria, will play against the next fixture, which is one team from level two playing against winner of 11-12. Let's confirm the team of level two who will play against winner of 11-12, Mozambique, Mauritius. Ghana. Ghana. So Ghana will play against winner of Mozambique, Mauritius, and the winner will play against the fixture of winner 9 and 10 versus Algeria. The next team from level 2. This team will play against the winner of 13-14, Burkina Faso, Gambia. Senegal. Senegal will play against the winner of Burkina Faso, Gambia. And the winner of this match will play against the next fixture, which is match 15-16, Libya, Rwanda, versus the team that will be drawn now. Okay. Mali. Mali. Mali will play against the winner of Libya, Rwanda. And the winner of this fixture will play against uh, the winner of March 13-14 versus Senegal. The last two fixtures, the next team from level two, will play against the winner of Madagascar, Seychelles. Let's confirm this team. Gabon. Gabon will play against the winner of Madagascar, Seychelles. And the winner of this fixture will play against the winner of Angola, Namibia, versus the team that will be drawn now. The last team in the draw. Cameroon. Cameroon will play against the winner of 1920, which is Angola, Namibia. And the winner of this fixture will play against the winner of the previous one, Madagascar, winner of Madagascar, Seychelles, versus Gabon. So, ladies and gentlemen, this concludes our drawing of lots for the qualifiers of the Under-23 Africa Cup of Nations, Morocco 2023. The third, the third round is explained in the pictures, as we were explaining also during the, the draw. So, it's by the order of the matches, according to the order of the draw that we established. So... Uh, the final tournament will be played in June 2023. Let me also confirm the dates of the qualifiers. The first round will be played from 19 to 27 September of this year. The second round, first leg, is 21 to 23 October. Second uh, leg, 28 to 30 October. And the third and final round, 20 to 28 March 2023. Seven teams will be qualified to the final tournament in addition to Morocco, the host. And this final tournament will be played in uh, June 2023 and is qualifying to the Olympic Games Paris 2024. So thank you, everyone, and good luck for all the teams.